Railway operations on the Nsawam route have currently been halted following a derailment on Tuesday evening. Engineers are working around the clock to move the derailed coaches. No casualties, however, recorded. Since 6 a.m., engineers of the Ghana Railway Company have been busy trying to move the derailed coaches back onto the railway line. They have successfully moved that coach back onto the line, but are still trying to move this one. So far, they have been able to move just one end, and will have to move back to the other end uh, to get it back on the line. It's likely to take a few days before they are able to complete this task. With a hydraulic jack and other equipment, the engineers gradually move the coaches onto the track. Though portions of the rail line are damaged, officials are yet to assess the extent. It is also unclear what caused the derailment. Fortunately for, for us, we have some of the uh, rail lines, we have some scattered around. We only have to bring them and just fix it back. I've spoken to the head at the district superintendent of track. He has also assured me that we get some of the materials and we to put the line back on track. In the meantime, the area manager of the Ghana Railway Company is certain rail operations will resume soon. Hopefully, I'm hoping that by Friday, um, train services will resume. We have two sets for Tema. So the other one is now at Circle, Odona. So in the evening, it will come, come closer and it picks the passengers and go back to Tema. So the thermal line is working. Four out of seven coaches went off the tracks shortly after taking off at about 5.30 p.m. on Tuesday, carrying over 500 passengers. Despite the imminent danger, hawkers who ply their trade on the train tracks have returned to business.